So even though you're a bendy and you probably don't need a yoga mat, even though a lot of my bendies love yoga because you are so good at being flexible and hypermobile, as you age, you do become stiffer and even your loose joints sometimes can get stiff and then they get this limited motion. So I do even have my bendies who are menopausal, postmenopausal, doing mobility routines because what's really kind of cool is, is as the arthritis sets in with aging, it sometimes helps stiffen you up, but then I need to maintain the integrity of your joint. And I I do a lot of things called CARs, which are controlled articular rotations. And these CAR routines help us get the motion we need in all our joints that are stiff. So my particular routine that I'm doing for my mobility, and I am not a bendy, is at the top of my page. A lot of my women that have EDS and they are postmenopausal, they might have hip replacements, they have significantly tight calves, they have st significantly stiff thoracic spines, they don't have the same level, usually a spontaneous uh, subluxation that they once did when they were earlier, but I do know once we uh, past 40, whether you're EDS or not, we're losing muscle bulk. And then there is this deconditioning that happens that's really horrible. But I have worked with women for a long time and finding a physical therapist, finding a personal trainer to come alongside you and help you get mobility in the joints you need, stability in the joints you need, walking small bits, and kind of getting a generalized wellness program because deconditioning is one of the sad things that happens when you have EDS. But there can be change. Now the expectations are a little bit different. For instance, my women that are exceptionally hypermobile, hyper I have some super bendy bendies, oftentimes 1.25 miles is about as long as they can walk. Um, some of my midline bendies can walk two miles, but these women each have a modified exercise routine that matches their orthopedic limit, but helps them gain some strength and helps them gain cardiovascular health and get blood flow to their tissues because I need the muscles to be strong to stabilize the joints because your muscles technically aren't affected. It's the tendons, ligaments, and fascia. Uh, the nerves are also stretchy, but the muscles have the ability to be saved, which is quite miraculous. So if you haven't found a physical therapist that specializes in EDS that can help you in your area or a personal trainer that specializes in EDS, because here in Dayton, Ohio, there are personal trainers and physical therapists that specialize in it, and I promise they can help you huge.